Hey, hello, YouTubers, and welcome to another episode of the Tiny Backyard Food Forest. I am super excited. I just noticed that the tendril across from this uh, watermelon has dried up, and that is supposed to mean that uh, the watermelon is ripe. So, here we go. I'm gonna do it. Oh, there she goes. And I will meet you inside. We will cut it open. So it is actually an 84 degree day here in the Pacific Northwest, which is pretty toasty. And um, my kitchen is also quite toasty. So I thought, let's go ahead and cut into this thing outside. Um, so this is a, a tiger baby watermelon. And it's weighing in at, was that eight pounds? Oh, there we go. Eight pounds, 9.8 .8 ounces. Um, pretty good, not bad at all. And I'm not sure how I'm gonna do this with one hand, but I'm gonna give it a shot. Oh my God, it's so pretty. Look at that thing. What a gorgeous melon. All right, stay put. And all right. Oh, that looks gorgeous. Look at that. Not too many seeds. Oh, that looks good. Let's give it a taste. Boy, that is juicy. I don't know if you can see that or not, but holy cow. Oh my God. It's warm from the sun. Sweet as could be and just delicious. So that's the first tiger baby of the season. We also have a uh, crimson sweet that will ripen up just uh, here, should be ripening up here pretty soon. So as I'm sitting here enjoying my fresh tiger baby watermelon, I noticed I have an audience. This little crocodile down here. Want some? Ah, here you go. This little lady over here. Oh, Zelda, want a baby? And this little guy down here. You want some tanker? Wish them. There you go, buddy. So I think it's unanimous. This is one good melon. Thanks for watching.